Good morning, everyone. This is Gary at Taster17 on the Noshbox channel. We are in South Sea now delivering our food boxes from the uh, Taste restaurant. Uh, we are doing our essential boxes, as you may have seen online. So if you need anything, please do give us a shout. We have got veg boxes. We can pretty much get our hands on anything that you want. So give us a shout. Uh, this is going to be part of my daily vlog now. So while I'm out and about delivering boxes, I can uh, talk to the camera, talk to someone because the streets are pretty barren. Portsmouth is on lockdown, so um, yeah, watch this space. We'll keep doing vlogs. Uh, myself and John unfortunately can't do videos together at the moment because of the um, close proximity we'd have to be on camera. Um, so um, you're just gonna have to put up with me for a while and then John can put videos up as well while he's doing his deliveries. We're dropping the food boxes off, uh, just done Hillsy, uh, two in Hillsy, and uh, believe it or not, my car's going in for an MOT today. Uh, just missed it by a day, government regulations came out this morning and said if your car needs MOTing after the 1st of April, then you can hold off for six months. So I've missed that one by a day, never mind. We'll get it in for an MOT, um, and I'll give it a good sanitise when I pick it up to make sure it's nice and germ free. And that's where we're off to now. We're off now to Waterlooville to do our last two drops. It's a gorgeous sunny day outside for people who haven't been outside or are locked up and locked inside. Uh, keep, up, keep watching these vlogs, you better see the, um, what's going on in the outside world, hopefully. Uh, we'll give you a little glimpse of the day-to-day -day life in a, a lockdown Portsmouth. Uh, if you need us, give us a shout. We'll get boxes to you, we'll get food to you as long as we can. And um, it generally looks like people are keeping common sense. The streets aren't that busy, there's not many people out walking. There's a few people down Canoe Lake, they were um, walking around, getting probably a little bit too close than they should have. Uh, it's getting a little bit busy, um, so it's probably somewhere to watch and avoid if you're uh, conscious about getting too close to people. Canoe, Canoe Lake was quite busy. Uh, otherwise, you know, the town was um, really quiet, sort of movie, movie style quiet. And uh, we're off to Waterloo with that to our last two drops, like I said. The absolute good news story at the moment, if you're getting fuel for your car to go anywhere or go to work, then uh, as there is only like one pound, two p a litre at the moment, which is incredible. Uh, so my, my journey from uh, Romsey to Port of the day has become a whole lot cheaper than it used to be, which is epic news. I'm gonna take any good news I can get in these current climates. Uh, I would say one thing though, if you are going to petrol pumps and petrol stations, it is probably worth taking your own pair of gloves because I've been to two petrol stations today uh, and they didn't have any gloves or latex gloves available to uh, handle the petrol pumps. And uh, I was reading an article yesterday, they said this is one of the main sources of contamination at the moment. People um, handle, coughing into their hand, obviously handling petrol pumps and then um, somebody coming along next and getting petrol from themselves. So if you are going to a petrol station, I would take a pair of gloves or a little bottle of sanitizer to sanitize the pump before you use it. Okay, so that's it guys, that is Gary at Taster17. Um, I've been out uh, delivering my boxes. I know John's been out delivering his boxes too, split up into two teams. Uh, there's been lots of demand. Unfortunately, supermarkets haven't got the supplies and they're not getting out to people. So if you do need food, you do need supplies. We've got veg boxes, essential supply boxes, which have got bread, milk, flour, sugar and stuff in. Uh, we're looking at meat boxes by the weekend. So if you need food by this weekend, we're doing a delivery day Saturday, so please, uh, get in contact on our WhatsApp group, uh, which is 0797 4790599. That's 0797 4790599. That takes you through to our WhatsApp group at Taste, and we can take your order there and we can be in contact with each other about what you would like and get your delivery this weekend if you order by Friday at midday. Uh, failing that, we've got a Wednesday delivery following that. If you are desperate, give us a shout and we will get food to you as fast as we can if you're really, really desperate. Um, like I say, please like and share the video. 
uh, let anyone you know um, who's struggling to get food, share the video to them and we, they can get in contact with us via that telephone number. We can get food out to them. So if their loved ones locked up or in self-isolation, we can get to them with food and supplies. So no one needs to panic, okay? Um, like Elon Musk said today, it's been a bit eerie outside. Uh, you would be surprised if Rick Grimes went past on a horseback. Uh, I've not seen any zombies out on the streets today. Oh, actually there's one bloke in Hillsy. He was dragging his feet. No, I don't think it was. I think we're all safe from zombies at the moment. It's been a really lovely, uh, lovely and sunny day outside, so it's been it's been nice to drive around. Sadly, left so many people are stuck at home, so I hope you had time to enjoy the garden if you've got a garden. Uh, please watch these videos and you'll get an insight of what's going around in the local area. You'll be able to see the streets and I'll give you an update on a daily basis of how the streets of the Portsmouth area are looking. Uh, please like and share, like I said, subscribe to the button, hit that little bell and you'll get, a, you'll get an alert as to when the next video comes up if you hit the uh, subscribe bell button and hopefully see you tomorrow when we go to the egg farm to pick up some eggs. Bye now. That's Gary and John out. The streets are empty.